the topic of the week is unicorns. Hi, I'm Ruby. Welcome to Focus Friends. And in this video, I'm going to show you five unicorn treats. So let's get started. So deep into it all. So you're gonna open the pocket. So you're gonna get a bowl, and once you've opened this fondant, or, or normal chocolate, like I said, is all you have to do is put some in. If you break it up, it'll be better. And melt it in the microwave. and open your ice cream cones. So this recipe is actually made without these chocolate things up front, but on my supermarket we didn't have any so chocolate. So because we already have some of the chocolate here, we're just going to make it go like that, like a bit wavy. Once you've done some, all you have to do is get some the sprinkles and put some on. Once you put the sprinkles on them, put them in a plate and leave them in the fridge till they hard, get hard. All you're gonna need is bread, and then on this bread, spread the melted chocolate. Now you have to put some sprinkles on it. So that will look like that. And now on the next bread, what you have to do is you have to have some mold. So I'll get this and break the bread with mold. And it'll look like that. Ooh. Reality, reality, Re -re reality. <laughs> oh no! Daddy, I'm trying to hide this. <laughs> Forget unicorn poop. No, it's not real poop. But it is burnt and it smells burnt. Back to the drawing board! <laughs> Preheat the oven to 375 Fahrenheit or 190 Celsius. You're going to need brown sugar and white sugar. And you're going to get a big bowl and mix three quarters of a cup of brown sugar and three quarters of white sugar. So next you're going to add one teaspoon of vanilla extract and one egg. And mix it with a one quarter of a cup of flour. And also, you have to put one teaspoon of baking powder in, but I haven't got that and my mum said that baking soda works the same. I don't know, I'm just going to test it. And add half a teaspoon of salt. Melt half a cup of margarine in the microwave. I 
add a bit of milk so it gets a bit more uh, dough. want just add some chocolate chips or raisins next I split the mixture because I wanted to try two different things I think I think I'll try some you wash your hands I think that is boss. No! So I got the pan ready. And I put some foil on it so it was ready for when I needed it. So I took one half of the dough that I split into two and I split it into four more little bowls. So I could put one colour into each bowl. In one bowl I put red, in another one I put yellow, and in the other two I put blue and green. So you can split them into more bowls to have more colours if you want. Just go experimenting on the cookie sheet. What I did was kind of like put them in colour blocks, but you can like actually make shapes and stuff. Or you can add a bit more flour so you can just mold them. Remember before when you separated the cookie dough into two groups? Well, the half that is still remaining, add some flour to it so then you're able to mold it with your hands. Next, get a knife, it doesn't have to be a sharp knife, and cut the dough into a triangle. Next, you should cook the cookies. Um, I don't know the exact time to cook them because they all close at different times. The approximate was 15 to 20 minutes, but just go check in them every now and then. And once they're cooked, take them out and let them cool off for a while. And then get the triangle cookies and melt some white chocolate and just put them on top. Afterwards, cover them with sprinkles to make them look like unicorn horns. Hi everybody, Ruby here. I hope you liked that video and if you did, give it a big thumbs up. Also subscribe to our YouTube channel and we've even made an Instagram account. Our name is Focus underscore Friends so don't forget to follow us there. I'll leave a link in the description to it. Don't forget to check out the other girls' videos. Christina's made a room unicorn room decor video and she's shown all of her unicorn stuff. And Mariam's made a unicorn slime video. Karis didn't want to do one this week, but so definitely send a video next week. So don't forget to check out our video next week, which is going up on Sunday in the afternoon. Bye.